What we're going to do with this colony is we're going to take a box off and we're going to take, try to take as many uh, open larvae frames as we can because we want to have nice young bees. We keep our colonies in three deep boxes here and so this top box is going to be pretty full of honey this time of year. Oh my god. That's a lot of honey. <laughs> Now we're going to move this to what is going to be the new location. We're looking for the queen and we're going to take any young brood that we find out. This is where you do that speedy part. <laughs> go through uh, that middle box again. Yeah. Look at that. Right on the top cover. That's why you always look at the top cover before yeah. you go throw it in the grass. We're going to take this queen and put it in the divide that we already made. And we're going to place her in a cage. And we're going to put duct tape over the hole because we don't want her to get out. So we just stick it between a couple of frames. And she's just going to stay in that cage till this afternoon now when we shake the bees. This is a frame that came out of the bottom box but had some open larvae on it. Okay, and back to this colony, we're going to put all the frames back in. And we have a queen that we're going to put in here because they're going to need a new queen. We don't want them raising their own queen like they would in a swarm. And so we're going to introduce this queen. So we're going to leave this colony now. And we're going to come back this afternoon during that time the foragers would go out and they will uh, forage and when they come back they don't know we moved the box they'll return over here so most of the old uh, crabby bees are going to go back to the other colony so when we shake a package from this we'll have nice friendly bees to do a bee beard we're going to shake three pounds of bees in here and then we're going to put the queen in there and that's going to be sort of our fake swarm so remember when we made up this box of bees, we um, put frames of larvae in here so that we have young nurse bees that are on there. Um, and we have the queen which we're going to put into the package. <laughs> okay, since Joe is going to be the one who is going to have the bee beard put on him tomorrow, it's best that he shakes the bees and gets to know them really well. So I'm going to hand him the frames and he'll shake and I'll watch the scale. We got about two pounds of bees. We probably, we'd like to have three for the official uh, day. We're gonna have three. This is gonna be our practice day. We'll put a jar with sugar syrup on. We're gonna move it to a cool, dark place where they will 
sit and wait until tomorrow afternoon when we're going to do the bee beard.